Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel Retain e-commerce tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about product filter by categories. So let's see how can we filter the products by category. So first of all, uh, let's display here after this brand and after this size, just display here the all categories. Okay, and uh, product count uh, from the particular category. So go to the shop controller and uh, inside this index method uh, let's uh, fetch here the all categories so after this let's create here another variable which is categories and fetch the categories so right here the model name category colon 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 order by order by and pass here the column name name and pass here the order which is ascending so right here asc and now call the get method okay now let's pass this categories to the view so inside this array just write here categories arrow dollar categories okay now save this file now go to the soft.play.php file and let's find the category list. So here is the color, size, price, size and this is the category. Okay. So inside this evil tag just add here the 4H, 4H directive and dollar categories as dollar category okay now cut this li and paste inside this for each and now just remove the remaining li so select this li and just delete okay now display here the category name so right here dollar category arrow name and display here the product count in the particular category so right here dollar category arrow products arrow count okay and uh, here just uh, remove this and add here the category id so right here dollar category arrow id okay and let's copy and paste inside the value so remove this one and paste here Okay, now save this file and let's check this category. So go to the sub, sub page and just refresh the page and you can see here the category list. Okay, and their product count. Now let's make this checkbox working. So go to the sub controller and here now after this uh, category, uh, just create another variable which is q underscore categories okay and then uh, assign the value from the query strings right here request arrow query and pass here the key q uh, sorry categories all right and now uh, just pass this Q categories to the view. So right here, single quote and just right here, the Q underscore categories arrow dollar Q underscore categories. Okay, and also copy this where and put here the arrow sign and paste here and now change here the uh, variable name so let's copy this and paste here also change the variable here 
okay and now change here the column name so right here category id category underscore id now save this file and go to the soft.play.php file and inside the filter form let's copy this input hidden field and paste here change the name id and value so right here categories okay and also change here categories okay now let's create another javascript function for the filtered product by categories so let's copy this function and paste here change the function name so right here filter product by category okay and checkbox name which is let's find the checkbox name this one which is categories okay so right here name is equal to categories and also change the variable name so right here categories okay now let's copy this javascript function uh, function name and uh, from the checkbox let's call this function so inside this category category checkbox just add here the on change event on change and just call this function and inside this just pass here this okay and also uh, let's copy this if directive and just copy this one and paste inside this this checkbox okay so paste here change the variable name which is category category arrow id and change here the variable name q underscore categories Okay, now it's done. So save this file. Okay, now let's check again. So go to the soft page and refresh the page. All right, it's showing the all product. Now let's filter the product according to the category so in this category you can see here there is one product so just select this checkbox and now you can see here one product if i check more category uh, inside this category you can see here the three products so let's check in this category and now you can see here one plus three four you can see here the four products okay if i uncheck this you can see here only three product which is belonging uh, belongs this category okay so in this way you can filter products by the category so that's all about filter product by category don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks for watching